Hey what's up people this is Deathbringer here and welcome back to some more Search and Destroy. You are witnessing right here right now today the birth of another thousand plus short subscriber based this time around on Modern Warfare 3. You are watching episode 1 right now which is going to be the model 1887. Um, a while ago I said I was going to be doing this show but I never actually got round to it because I was trying to sort out loads of equipment and stuff like that and just trying to figure out how I was going to sort of present it basically. And as you can see I've got this like brand new layout um, that I designed in Photoshop uh, and it's going to continue all the way through the series. You get to see my face while uh, <laughs> you're, you're watching this video and I don't know, I just think it's a little bit more interactive if you can actually see me talking about this person's gameplay today and sort of describing what I think was good about it and you know all, the, all that other sort of um, shinizzle, whatever you want to call it, right? Uh, yeah, so I think it's going to be cool. I think it's going to go well. This is the Thousand Plus Show, episode number one, model 1887, submitted by uh, Mayor Bryce. I can't say it correctly. I think it's Meh. Meh. That's how I'd say it. Mayor Bryce. Like Chavi. <laughs> um, that's what it sounds like, anyway. So, today, model 1887, we haven't had this gun on my channel for quite a long time. And. Uh, it's it's a very interesting shotgun I've got to say and, and he's done well in this game play to gain 20 kills using the specialist um, setup he doesn't actually have kill streaks on which is what I would usually want, run on all the classes you know that I use in search and destroy but he seems to do pretty well here I noticed throughout the gameplay he seems to take the same routes in the beginning and it sort of slowed it down a little bit because there weren't a lot of enemies coming this way. Um, his teammates um, kept dying a few times and he got um, lucky here and there and that's what kind of leads to this big 20 kills. I think this gameplay overall is pretty, pretty cool, you know, it's a really good... Um, display of sort of using he used his mind in certain situations which is what i like to see from you guys you know if if you ever sub submit a gameplay to me or if you want to submit a gameplay for this files and plus show i really like to see people who think about what they're doing and not just run about um you know mindlessly and because that's that's when people get killed and people get um irritated so He's on the uh, attacking side now, and he's going to go up this middle cor corridor in a moment after he shot this guy with a lucky shot right here. Um, I would, if you're going down this middle corridor, I would advise that you just run straight down it, because he has a couple of problems here in the next round, I think, going down this corridor. He gets shot at and he backs off a couple of times, but other than that, he's doing pretty well. Um... He just missed the guy in, in the corner of his eye, which I which I saw when I was watching um, this gameplay back. You see, he almost got shot shot then, but he pulled it around, and uh, you know the the only reason they lost that round was because his team weren't particularly watching the bomb. Um, you know, there's a, there was a lot going on in that previous round. Um, you know, which you can't really. Um, I would like to like go ahead and criticize him for not protecting the bomb, but there was a lot going on that you know he was thinking about so much, and that's still good to see even though he lost the round. Um, so he's gonna move up here, and he's gonna come around this corner, bang right there, and one more, and I think there's another one coming along here. He's using Sitrep Pro, which I don't have much experience with. I know a lot of people use it, and a lot of people recommend it for search and destroy. Um, but he must be using a headset because he goes to plant the bomb a couple of times here and he keeps getting up to kill people uh, so that's just his kind of style of, of gameplay um, you know it's kind of interesting to see 
people play like this because I don't play like that myself. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that's why I'm telling you about it. He's using sit rep. I wouldn't you normally use like stalker or something like that um, for purposes such as you know dodging uh, claymores and bouncing betties. I use stalker and obviously because I can strafe faster when I aim down my sights, which win wins me a lot more um, close quarters gun battles. But he's sort of um, sitting around and. Uh, walking around and, and you know being steady and sort of sound whoring people basically and it's quite an interesting tactic that I've sort of picked up on after watching this gameplay a few times from this guy um, it's quite interesting and I think you guys would um, you know like take notes on that if, if you if you're using a headset I always think about this a lot actually um, people using headsets automatically think they're gonna get better at the game but if you're not using like the right perks and the right setups and you're not thinking about what you're doing, it's not going to help you that much. Um, I like this um, decision right here, what he makes. This is what I was talking about, about this middle corridor. Um, he was going to have a little bit of trouble going down it. He um, makes a small mistake there and the guy comes out, tries to shoot him, he backs off, um, which I was like very happy to see. Uh, he goes back around and... He takes a couple of stabs at this guy and he actually eventually gets him because he's now got his specialist bonus on and he's got like recon on and all that sort of stuff which is pretty cool. Um, so there's not really much I can say more about this gameplay apart from I hope you've enjoyed this episode. I think it's been pretty entertaining, you know, you get to see people that basically isn't me you get to see subscribers such as yourselves and and maybe it might be friends that might be submitting gameplays you know you get to see them playing you get to see different people's tactics and stuff like that so it's coming to the end of the gameplay now and that's pretty much it guys so i would like to ask if you would like to submit gameplays please leave them as a video response to this video um upload your gameplays to youtube leave them as a video response i'll take a look at them and they must be a thousand plus guys using a gun that hasn't been done yet and you will be featured in the thousand plus show if that made sense at all so thanks for watching this was deathbringer and I hope you've enjoyed this like sort of new layout, you know, with the buttons and stuff. Um, yeah, so that's it. Um, my outro is about to play. So thanks for watching. This was Deathbringer once again. Have a nice day. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? It's over nine thousand.